Hey guys, what's up? We are back with another Tech Talk from Nexus. And today we have a very special guest, Chris Lima. He's going to be telling us all about our new plugin performance monitor. And we're super excited to have him. Hi, Chris. Hey, how are you? <laughs> Doing good. So um, tell us, why did Nexus build the plugin performance monitor? That's a great question. So every single website owner out there and frankly, every developer who built the website has always had this situation where um, you get the website built for you, you get it perfect, uh, you run it through some performance monitoring and it gets a great score. And then over the course of time, as people are uploading plugins, changing themes, uh, uploading photos, whatever it is that they're doing, the website gets slower and slower. And the and the owner is like, hey, what happened to my website? They're looking over the developer. The developer's like, what happened to my pristine website that I built? How come they're making it slower? And everybody gets a little bit frustrated. And the and the the bottom line is that every one of the actions we take on a website, every plugin we install, every plugin we update, uh, every theme change we make, everything we do can affect performance. But until now, you had no feedback loop. You had no idea how to connect the dots between cause and effect. So someone uploads a photo and its site doesn't slow down. Someone uploads another photo and it does. Someone installs a plugin, it doesn't slow down. Someone installs another plugin, it does. And you had no idea which plugins were slowing your website down, which photos, which theme changes. And so we said, what if we built a solution that allowed you to check the performance on a daily basis and any time a site got slower or faster we could point to what actually changed and why this had an impact on your performance and that's what we set out to build and that's what we've created in the plugin performance monitor and it, it monitors plugins it also monitors themes and file changes so we call it the plugin performance monitor because plugins are one of the bigger drivers to, to needing that feedback loop, but but we cover it all. Wow, sounds like a great resource for store owners, site owners, all of them. So tell us, why now? Why did you guys make this now? Another great question. Here's the thing, right? Google has been announcing that they're making a change to how they evaluate uh, site performance. And for the longest time, Google's already done this, where if your site takes too long, it just falls off the Google search results. So you might have a super fast site or store, and then as it gets slower, you notice, oh, it's not showing up for the same keywords it used to. That's because Google looks at a slow performing website and says, that's not very user friendly. So when you think about um, page weight, when you think about uh, load times, when you think about all these things that are related to the performance of your site, if those things are getting slower and slower and slower, you're disappearing and Google's done that already, but now Google's focused on an even greater driver towards, and they've created some new metrics on performance. And so what we wanted to do was create a, a solution that helps every site owner out there know what's going on with their own site and make sure that it stays as fast as possible. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's super important. So who has access to this? That's the great thing, right? So this isn't a paid add-on. This isn't something that only people who are running WooCommerce stores can have. Every single WordPress and WooCommerce store on the Nexus platform gets it. You also can't download this and take it somewhere else, right? So this is Nexus customers and our service to them so that they all know, every one of the WordPress and WooCommerce stores out there, um, they know how well they're performing. Well, we're super excited to have this. I think it's going to be a great asset for all the site owners, store owners. And thank you so much, Chris, for talking with us today. My pleasure. Um, and thanks everybody for watching. Be sure to tune in next week for our next 5-Minute Tech Talk. And be sure to follow us on all our platforms. Bye, guys. <laughs>